Know it. Know your worth and do not give discount. I'm going to say it again. Know your worth. Know your value and do not give any discount to nobody and to anything. Because once you know your worth and you accept how powerful, how valuable, how worthy you are. You are going to stop hanging out with people who treat you less, with people who think you are an option, with people who think they can find somebody better than you. If they think they can find something better than you, let them go. If they don't think that you are the shit, let them go. But before them thinking that you are the shit, you have to know you are the shit. You have to know how powerful, how worthy, how valuable you are before somebody else telling you that. Because think about it. How many times you stay with people that don't care about you, that don't support you, that don't believe in you, that don't bring nothing positive to your life. But you stay with them because you think you deserve that. Because you think you cannot be in a better place. Because you think nobody can see your worth. Because you think you deserve less. I'm here to tell you those self-limitations, they got to go. Those self-limitations, they got to go. Look around you. Is there anybody else like you in the entire universe? No. So why are you out here minimizing, treating yourself solo? Thinking, oh no, I cannot do it. Oh no, I'm not good enough. Oh no, I'm weak. Oh, I cannot make it. Oh, I'm ugly. I'm, I'm sleeping on yourself, thinking that you are low, is gonna keep you low. You have to see yourself as high as you can, as amazing as you possibly can. Because if you don't know your word, you're gonna keep entertaining people. Who bring drama, who bring negativity, who disrespect you. If you don't know your word, you are going to do the impossible just to be at the party, just to be at the restaurant, just to be at the club, just to be in anything that anybody here is doing, just for people to invite you, just for people to accept you, just for people to validate you. You don't need no validation from nobody. You don't need no permission from nobody. Do you know why? Because when you were born, you did not ask nobody to be here. And once you are here, it's on you to make your life as great, as amazing that you are. Once you start accepting and acting as the powerful being that you are, you will start removing your, your place from people who are like, oh, they think you don't have it. They think you can't make it. They think you are, you, you are amazing. They think you are not fabulous. They think you are not the shit. Well, let them go. Let them go. This idea of you looking at yourself, seeing yourself solo, where does it come from? Where does it come from? Imagine what can happen if you treat yourself as somebody who's powerful, somebody who's a billionaire, a trillionaire, somebody who's strong, somebody who's wise, somebody who's intelligent, somebody who's confident. Imagine if you treat yourself or if you see yourself as somebody who has those positive and high and amazing qualities. Just imagine. But a lot of you are giving discounts. You are giving access to the wrong people, to your life, because you think you are not good enough, because you think you are not strong enough, you are not beautiful enough, you are not confident enough, you are not wise enough. You are not capable enough. Because you see because you you see yourself solo, you keep yourself in, in cheap and low standards. You gotta go. Keep yourself in high standards. Demand, command from yourself. Command respect. Command success. Command happiness from yourself. Because since you you have low standards, you are minimizing yourself. You see yourself solo. You are giving people assets to you. You are giving them discount. There is no discount. There is no discount. If nobody doesn't come to pay the full price of your worth, which means that person is going to treat you as the high. That person is going to put you in a pedestal, which is where you have to put yourself. You have to put yourself in a pedestal. You have to put yourself in the highest status 
of society. So you can start treating yourself as someone that you care for. Stop sleeping on yourself. Stop playing it cheap. Stop giving people discount so they can have access to your life. Whoever think you ain't good enough, whoever think you are low, whoever think you are nothing, cut them off from your life. Whoever will be like, oh no, oh, oh. <laughs> noise. If the person cannot articulate, cannot make you see that you are powerful, that you are worthy, that you are the shit, that person gotta go. Stop giving the wrong people access to your life. Stop being around people who put you low, who put you down, who treat you as a shit. Stop being around those people. Choose to be alone over being with people who bring negativity, who bring drama to your life. Stop having low standards. Low standards are going to keep giving you low quality life experiences. But the moment you go high, as high as you can, as big as you can, you are going to see how you are receiving high, amazing, and positive experiences. Have some high standards for yourself. Demand, command from yourself. And you command from yourself because you are in charge of yourself. Because you are the only one you can control. You are the only one you can change. You are the only one who is in charge of your life. So keep yourself in high standards. Tell yourself that you are going to stay high. Which means you are going to remain disciplined, consistent. You are going to love yourself. You are going to believe in yourself. You are going to respect yourself. You are going to respect yourself to the point that whenever you are in a room where people don't value you, you are able to get up and leave that room. Again, stop giving people discount. You are worthy. You are powerful. You are good enough. Whoever cannot see how powerful you are, don't give that person access to your life and don't give that person no discount. Keep yourself in high standards. There is nothing positive about you having cheap, low attitudes. For what? You have one shot in life. Imagine if you, if you can make that one shot as high, as bright, as big as you can, as big as the universe, as high as the universe. That's how high and that's how big you should keep yourself.